How are we doing, guys? What is going on? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Collecting Havoc. I am John. I'm the host of these shenanigans, and we're going to go on a local toy hunt. I've been hearing rumors Target's having clearance season. So we're hoping my area actually gets it on time. That would be great. But uh, other than that, I'm not really looking for anything. We're going to see if there's anything crazy new on the pegs. It has been a little lean in the area. And I think some of that is because this Friday, tomorrow, for you guys, because it's, what is today? Today's Tuesday or Wednesday. I lose track of days. But uh, I'm posting this on Thursday, so tomorrow will be PulseCon. Let me know down in the comments. What are you looking forward to at PulseCon? Because uh, I'm looking forward to a lot. I might, I might uh, go through a little bit of that in the uh, wrap-up uh, before we hit the toy table. Um, I think the only thing I got left to do before I go look at toys is the spiel. You guys, if this is the first time to your, ch to your channel, to my channel, not your channel, my channel, uh, repeat viewer, all that other good stuff, uh, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Join the tens of followers of Collecting Havoc. And uh, join in on the adventures. It's, it's a great time. We're all hanging out, having a good time, and looking at toys. Also, guys, if you guys are enjoying my content, make sure you hit that like button. It helps me, and it helps you, because what it does is it tells YouTube that you like toy hunt style videos. Not only will it recommend more of my videos, it'll recommend more videos in the genre. So you may find a new YouTuber that you never knew existed. Maybe it's how you found me. I don't know, but that like button is very important. Also, if you do want to know when I drop content, which I do try to do three times a week, make sure you hit that notification bell and then also turn on notifications in your YouTube app so you actually get those notifications from me and any other YouTubers you do follow and have that notification bell hit. And then, uh, you know what, guys? On that note, we're going to go look at toys. I came into Kenosha, and it is literally the same as a couple days ago. We got the two packs, and the Grand Army of the Republic Battle Packs. We got these Hot Wheel things. Lando. Leia, Lando, and there's a Lando back there. So, yeah, this is about it. And there's really loud music above me, so I'm out of here to the next section. All right, quick run into Kenosha. And two days. More resacks of the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Two case restock of that. I knew I should have waited on that for the long game, but that's all right. More white labels, white labels. So, definitely gonna play a long game on all this stuff. We're gonna check to see if he's clearance today, but that's crazy. That's three targets in three day, two days. So they had all had the restocks, but nothing else, nothing new. Miles lost his head. They had no other restocks. We're still seeing Dirty Dusty, Copperhead, Canary Guards, Dirty Dusty, Shipwreck. Ton, uh, a couple of the Batwings seem to be gone. Unless they moved them. Nope, nope. We got Tim Drake Robin. So, I think that's new. I don't remember seeing him here last time. Got a couple of Hush Batmans. Ocean Master, this is still 21 bucks. That needs to be a little bit lower before I grab them. So now, I gotta see if I'm actually tempted to get all the Jokerized. That doesn't look as good as the Jokerized Joker does. And then, yeah. Nothing else over here. Sorry for the screaming kid. The usual down there. And then, soups versus soups. Oh, there's another Batwing, so they're just moving stuff around. Miles lost his head. All right, I'm going to see what else I can find here. Oh, look, they had new AEW, so I probably missed a chase because everyone seems to be finding a chase but me. I even missed it by five minutes in the last one. We'll keep looking. Huh, that's still a mess over here. It's been a couple days, but still got the Skeletor, Naked Stratos, random. But seeing that one new AEW... It's the only one from that wave. I don't see anything else. Oddest restock ever. Still old stuff. Skeletor. So, what do we got going on here? We got Point Dread. Uh, Turtle Lair. 
Turtles, Mutant Mayhem, Killer Croc random. Like I said, this, this side, for whatever reason, is just pure garbage. Yeah, so there's just dinosaurs, 90, the 93 classic stuff. Uh, Dino Trackers, what else we got here? We got the Hammond Collection, and then the stuff I don't know about. 93 Collection. There's all kinds of stuff there, but I looked through most of it. None of it is for us. So, and just this little section over here. We still got the Steel Clan robots back there. Goliath. Um, looks like Creature from the Black Lagoon has been snapped up, so missed out on that. Sorry if you did. Uh, yeah, I think it's been a couple days since we saw it, unless it's back here, but you know how that goes. Some of the elf stuff, T-800s, elf restock. Uh, Pokemon stuff. Uh, Poppy, Five Nights at Freddy's. Minecraft stuff. I, I say stuff because I have no idea what it is. Uh, Sonic stuff. Ooh, do they got Mr. Dr. Eggman? Nope, not today. I just think that's funny that they call him Mr. Dr. Eggman. But a lot of new Mario stuff, so that's cool. And then the same old movie stuff. So that's cool. Uh, I'm going to see if there's any end caps for clearance. We'll see if there's anything left in clearance or more end caps. And then we still got to check for NECA, like the main NECA section. All right, so coming back from checking on clearance on this, which it's not. Found this end cap, which we've seen a couple times, and it's just garbage. We still got creep show here, all this stuff down here. But there's weird random stuff that they threw over here. They're really starting to just run out of room. Well, if they didn't have Beyblade taking up the whole thing, they would have room, but they got to put all their Beyblade in there. So, all right, we got in. Oh, that's the first time I've seen that here. Usual stuff, and then yeah, no more than new AEW wave except for that one figure we found in the other aisle. That was weird. All right, let's take a quick look here. It's getting a little busy, so I want to get out of people's way. Got Black Noir, Black and White Frankenstein, some horror stuff, the usual Toonie Terrors and NECA stuff, tons and tons of plushies. I know I was talking to the vendor a couple, like a month or so ago, and he said that's all they've been sending them is all this plushy stuff, so. And then the usual, there's not a whole lot new over here that we didn't see last time. So, Elf Restock. Pops, uh, Pop Anime First Form Freezes on clearance. Wow, really? If and the mini fi some minifigures, I don't know. But yeah, there's not a whole lot standout-ish, new and amazing to show. It's just the you know business as usual. But what's nice is it's stocked. It's not empty pegs, so that's kind of cool. Huh. So they're selling through their inventory of NECA here, but at the same time, they ain't restocking nothing. So remains to be seen how they do their restocking here. I, I did actually reach out to NECA when they advertised their deal with Meyer to say, hey, how are we, what's the restock plan, et cetera, et cetera. You know, it's, mine's had stuff for almost six months now and no restock so obviously it's been two weeks and no answer so we'll see all right so we did see in the last south milwaukee run that meyer did add some new stuff so we're gonna see if they did it here in my local and not just oak creek but they got some of this stuff kind of seeing that everywhere huh, that's cool they got those now i just don't see any tags so i don't know how they're doing their collectible section over here and as you can see it is all Legos all day long. And they got some new stuff. Uh, old stuff, you know, kind of a mix of everything. Vader's TIE Bomber. Uh, what is that thing called? The Inquisitor ship? Yeah. Got a New Republic E-Wing versus Shin Haiti, Starfighter, stuff like that. So I got some cool Lego stuff over here. I know I don't really look at Legos too much, but there's some cool stuff here. 
All right, back to action figures real quick. And it does not look like they did their restock here or their reset like they did at the Oak Creek. This looks like all the same stuff. Yeah, even the Transformers are the same. I mean, we even saw in the last video we had the new uh, Brawn video game wave with Cliff Jumper and Bumblebee from the movie. So, yeah, um, no new Avengers or the no Mark 1s, which I don't even know where they would put it. Oh, I take that back. Look at this. And then we'll wrap back around and we'll finish up the Legos. They did add the Puff Adder wave. So they have, okay, so they are going to do, they do have a peg for the Mark 1. They're doing this and then... Uh, Spider-Man assortment, so I'm assuming that's either the Spider-Man retro card we've all been seeing, or there's a retro card wave I don't know about. Or a Spider-Man wave we're getting soon, but, so that's cool. I mean, we've all been seeing this. It's been on clearance in some places. I mean, this is still 13 bucks on Target's website. So, anyways. Back to Legos. Super Mario, Minecraft, Dreams. Some of that looks like, like, that thing actually looks pretty badass. I ain't gonna lie. That looks pretty cool. I don't care colors or not. Uh, city stuff. Technics. Harry Potter. Uh, yeah, same old, same old. I think some of you guys that collect Legos might know this stuff better than me. Is any of this stuff actually new? I mean, other than the Dreams. I know the Dreams is new because I've never seen it until the last couple months. Alright, guys. So at least we know this stuff is coming. So that means if I don't find it on clearance at Target, I can use coupons to get it here. So that's cool. Oh, Squadron. <laughs> I, oh, they got the Republic gunship down there. That's cool. So there's that. All right, we're gonna go finish grocery shopping now. My cart's empty. And just as I was turning off the camera, boom, check this out. They got all of them here, and none of them look like they've been busted into. So that's cool. So at least, at least somewhere doesn't have them all busted into, so that's kind of cool. All right, now I'm going to go finish grocery shopping, unless there's something around the corner, which there is. There's more Legos. All right, guys. Um, Racine's looking all right off the bat. Um, so I'm going to apologize ahead of time if the audio sounds funky. I found a way to get rid of a little bit of background noise so that music isn't so loud. But it makes the talking parts a little choppy. So if this part sounds a little messed up, sorry guys. I'm going to say sorry ahead of time. But definitely check this out. Restock on rock and roll. That's a whole, that's what, 2K? What was it? What's in a case? Eight? Six? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, plus a shipwreck. We got two slow gung ho, and then Lady J's for days and days and days and days as usual. Naked Stratos got the rock has come back to Racine, Wisconsin. Macho Man, Series 98, top picks. 103, 93, 103, 103, 103, and then what's back there? We got another top picks. We got basics, top picks, new Power Rangers, old Power Rangers, new mission fleet with the new Ahsoka Jedi shuttle. We got Stone Cold, we got a ring, we got at at we got all this stuff for little kids and some of the new squadron freaks, fleet, fleet, fleet. We got all the blind bags, which looks like they got a bunch of speeder bikes. And holy TVC. Wow. That's all. One, two, three, five pegs of TVC. We got Cad Bane. Boba, boba, boba. Boba, boba, boba. Boba, boba, boba. Nin, nin, nin. We got Moff Jarrett. That's all. There's those three guys. This Nin, nin, Cad Bane. Ah, it's... Apparently, this is... If you guys can't find the TVC, they all came here. <laughs> This is. I bet you when I come back here in three days, this will be almost all gone. 
but I can't do 17 bucks. I think they're 13 or 14 bucks at Target, which is weird. And then we got the regular Bobas. And just remember, this is definitely the Walmart that does not have Lando. My Lando hunts are over. Although I still find him, so Lando hunts are never over. Dungeons and Dragons stuff, we all know that. It's all the old stuff, Jazzwares, Spinwares, Spin Master, whatever. Not on clearance, not on clearance, not on clearance. Check this, this is $40 on the app, so that's mispriced, but it's Grifters, Hush, um, Blue Beetle, Duke Thomas Infestation, Dinosaurs, 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 Dinosaurs. Sorry guys. Although I'm trying not to get hit by the music, but I also just don't want to have to do a lot of audio fixing because it is very difficult to do. Also, siren, so beautiful, so clingy, following me everywhere, still. Speedball, old stuff, old stuff, old stuff, nothing new in Legends. They do have the end cap, which I'm not even going to bother showing. We've all seen it a hundred times, just like most of this stuff. Um, Mutant Mayhem, Galore, uh, the Large Turtles, new and old. We got bots we got toxitron we got cloud cover uh we got jaxus we got all this stuff but and while i was waiting to film in this aisle i did come across something i haven't seen yet toxitron side sword. that's the first time i've seen him so that's cool uh laser cycle mirage mirage there's a jazz back there somewhere there's a jazz we got cross cut cr crash bar prowl is that the yeah, that's the bike version of Prowl, Crosscut, RC, Earth Spark stuff. This we got Blitzwing. So eh, not bad. I'm you know what? Oh, there's more. Is that Grimlock or is that oh, that's more Toxitron, right? What is that? That is. Oh yeah, more Toxitron. More Jaxus. So although it's not a lot of new stuff. That was cool with the TVC stuff, and then finally getting to see Toxitron, um, more Toxitron and the Sideswipe, which I have not seen yet. That's the first time for me. So we are going to see what's in NECA. If there's a NECA section, you'll see it. If not, next door. All right, so I was in the, what do you call this? What is this? This is the clearance aisle. Odd place for it, but they're here. And it says three. 48 are these four bucks a piece here someone's gonna find out if they are 348 i'll try to key, uh, take a screenshot all right so we'll we'll check out what's here i know a lot of people don't like pops but some people do and honestly some of these comic cover things are kind of cool um like i said i'm thinking about getting a couple on clearance just to pull the figures out and or the pops out and then put in some action you know some marvel legends or toddy max in them stuff like that what else we got we got broadway we got sh figure it's freezy here we got sam and twitch all the black adams in the world supergirl oh there's lando lando has been spotted this store has lando so that's why i couldn't find him last time i never came back here ha so you are hiding on me lando and then you got to restock on that robocop uh that's about it for here so let's uh move on to the next store okay let's see if racing gives us anything nifty and surprising we got some model kits blind bags we got the 50% off stuff up here. I'm assuming the 50% off is this uh, Avatar Aang. You know, I thought this was a painter proof, but that's just a gray and purple version. It's actually really cool looking. 12 bucks might be worth a try. I'm not a huge Gundam fan, but I'm a few fan of huge robots that kick ass. <laughs> so, we got Zenitsu. I think all of them are in there. I don't know, probably not. <laughs> Look at two freaking <laughs> Black Widows everywhere. So apparently people just didn't have it. I was going to say this was going to be the only Target without the white boxes, but they do have her. Wow, her. <laughs> apparently I got to pay attention to where I'm pointing. 
Ant-Man, worst miles ever. And then it looks like a lot of Electras, which I'm really shocked that this one isn't moving better because this is a really, really, excuse the camera, but this is a really good figure. I mean, honestly. So if you don't have it yet and you can get it at retail or less, highly recommend. I don't know the story, but just based on how this figure looks, worth it. Uh, little kid stuff down there. We got Shipwreck and Copperhead. The Duke Thomas infestation is here. Johnny Lawrence. Dirty Dusty. Uh, Black Lantern, Superman, Captain Cold, and the really lack of Transformers. So, as soon as the next aisle gets cleared out, there's a little kid playing with all the toys. So, I'll give him a chance to play with the toys, and then we'll go see what's in the other aisle. Or we'll look and see what's behind me first. Actually, remember, that's Mr. Doctor Eggman 2. Mr. Doctor. <laughs> Uh, Bowser, and then the rest of the Mario stuff, movie, Minecraft, Pokemon, if that's your thing. The end cap here is all random pops and Spider-Man stuff. Got the Transformers end cap, which is really down to stuff people don't want. That Megatron's kind of cool, but I'm not doing War for Cybertron, even though the game was fun. Oh, there's more Sonic stuff. It's all that Sonic Prime. That's actually a pretty cool Sonic. Interesting. Got knuckles. All right. But yeah, that's what we got going on over here. Lemmy the Koopa. All right, next section. Uh, let's see what we got here. Point Dread. Uh, New Adventure Skeletor. Sala. Sala. Richard Dreyfus. Mission Fleet. Old Andras. The most expensive. Wow. Well, no, after seeing the, the speeder bike, this is the second most expensive now. I need that little... I don't know, somebody let me know down in the comments if you want you want to send me this lightsaber. I'm missing that one. Or am I missing this one? Nope, missing that one. Uh, my God, I have, that is like the 10th freaking figure I've dropped today. Lando. McIntyre, okay. So I haven't seen that, okay. Oh, this is the rude build-a-figure. Wow, that is definitely a different looking Drew McIntyre. We got Becky Lynch from that wave. We got Taker. I love you, brother, love. And then that's it from that wave. Okay, those are not the ones I expected to be left on the pegs. <laughs> I expected the other two, so. And I'm back, sorry about that. Had a couple guys wanted to come through, look at the Hot Wheels. I didn't want to get in their way, but we got Whiplash and Ram Man down there. Him, movie mayhem stuff, storage shell, Leo and Donnie, and then dinosaurs. So, that's about it, dinosaurs. And lack of Hot Wheels, they, yeah, like I said, there's not much here. They weren't here very long. They thumbed through for like a moment, and then they were gone. So, must not be anything over there. Uh, monster trucks, indie cars, random stuff I don't know. I used to be a car guy, not anymore. I was a car guy back when these were popular. So, all right. I am gonna go see if there's anything I want or if there's another section to check out, and we'll be back. Eh, why not? Let's take a quick look at Legos. Look at that thing. That's pretty cool. Oh. If you know, you know. Uh, what do we got? Creators. A lot of this is... I don't think any of this is new. Not 100% sure. But, eh. I think... Everything here is pretty cool. The Batmobile. Batman. Batwing. Mini Batmobile. Technic. We got Back to the Future. The DeLorean. We got... Uh, Camaro Z28. Ooh, that's a 69. That's cool. Speed Champion stuff, more Technics, oh, Mars Rover, and then we got all this stuff. Actually, saw this at a Walmart for 50 bucks on clearance, so that's pretty cool. 
and then yeah all this stuff got new helmets boosh some star wars helmets captain rex that looks pretty cool harry potter that's that um, that thing and oh we got that that i don't i don't know what's new and what's not but there's your battle packs for ahsoka and anakin all uh, right let's move on okay what do we got um looks like we're just doing an inventory check i'm not seeing anything new looks like it's the same stuff from the last time we we're here battle jam and shredder we got renette is that old fawn or a new fawn the fawn no that's the young one i have the old fawn it's actually not too bad so all right Let's see. Hmm. So, yeah, definitely these would be worth it if they weren't 35 bucks. They look kind of fun. That's actually pretty cool. Not really, I can't remember Garrick's from when I was a kid, but apparently he was in the cartoons. It's a pretty cool Flash Gordon. Ming is cool. We got dynamic figure stand. Regular figure displays, Bob Ross, Frankenstein accessory set. We got our spawns, we got the covers. And now, after talking about Electro Daredevil, because I mean, could you just imagine that Marvel Legend in there and that on display? That would be pretty cool, I think. I don't know, tell me if I'm an idiot or if I'm onto something. Okay, that's cool. That is actually pretty cool. And that's about it. Let's uh, see if there's anything else here. Otherwise, I'm going to the next store. Or ending the hunt. I'm not sure. I can't remember what order I'm doing this weekend. Uh, oh, is that... Oh, no, that's just the hockey mask for Casey Jones. I thought it was the ultimate. That's right. That's only at Walmart. All right. Looks like Burlington got... My Burlington got restocks of this guy. I didn't even notice there was writing on the gun. Interesting. Never noticed that before, but anyways, so number 11's eight bucks. That's a restock because I had them here last Christmas season or earlier this year, I should say. But let's see what's over. if there's anything else here. I'll put it on film, but I'm not seeing anything so far. Imagine X stuff and little kid stuff, but there's two more aisles now, and yeah, that's all little kid stuff, so we'll see. Uh, it looks like not much over here. This is where they keep the action figures, they got one of those. Uh, Godzilla's back there, cyber, Bumblebee cyberverse stuff, and then just a Ragsy Bush Ranger, and another number 11, so, yeah, not much. Where are these Fortnite figures going for? I heard this one's actually pretty fun to have. Eight bucks. It's the only one I haven't grabbed out of the wave. I have Ragsy, which actually really isn't a bad figure, so... All right, that's it for this Burlington. Maybe I'll find something else somewhere. Uh, got that, but that's about it, nothing else. And just for posterity's sake, I stopped here to see if they had any more of those arcade game turtles, but they do have them here, and then they, they're five bucks. Uh, where's the tag? Yep, let's see, five dollar stride orders. That's sad. Origins is a good line. It didn't deserve that. They just overproduced it, and obviously Mattel screwed up their distribution. Yeah, there's nothing here but that. Okay, I don't think I've been to Kenosha in a minute, at least Walmart, so. At least not anything to film. And as you can see, it really hasn't changed in the last three weeks. That's kind of depressing. I don't think, I honestly don't think I have seen anything new. Oh, no, 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 I take that back. They had the WWE superstars here last week, so I have filmed here recently. Uh, and this is it for th this stuff. Uh, I am Groot. Spider Rex, haven't heard from you in a minute. All right, he's dying. Battery's dying in there. I probably killed it. <laughs> uh, old waves of legends. Sirens still following me everywhere. Uh, X-Men 97 starting to sit. I think people, I think it's hit market saturation. I think it's had a couple of restocks because it was almost empty here. But anyways, on to 
Beast Boy Wave, some random page punchers. Been on the pegs a year and still not in clearance. Um, the Duke Thomas infestation is here too. Future State Batman, superpowers, Boba, 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 Boba Fett's, lots of them. So those are probably hit clearance at some point. Um, oh, new Fortnite, whatever. Um, okay, kind of looks cool. Uh, Lando, Lando, my old buddy Lando. Uh, Nin Nub. How do you say his name? Nin Nub? Nunb? I don't know. Honestly, don't know. And then there's Moff Gerard. So that's all that's left out of it. those. Ran a Fortnite head of the table. Page, Jimmy, uh, JBL, Roman, uh, not the Chase Hogan. Wow, somebody was hungry. Um, Mr. Perfect, Bam Bam. Um, I think one of these is the Chase, or that's the Chase. I don't know. Uh, Restock a rock and roll. We got some Baronesses. Lady J's for days. Too slow gung ho. Oh, I thought somebody was behind me for a minute. Ooh, scrap iron. Uh, Super Mario movie stuff. Beyblade. Samus. Zelda. Link. Sonic. Oh, they don't have the they don't have the Sonic Prime stuff here, so I can't say that's Mr. Doctor Eggman to you. That's going to be my new thing, I think. Mr. Doc. Oh, oh, can we get the cart through? Oh, look at that. Oh, someday you will be mine. And I will relive my childhood through that freaking jet, spaceship, whatever. <laughs> and yeah, that's all the Legos. Uh, and it's the world Walmart World Radio. Blue, 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 blue. <laughs> radio. God, that's so annoying. But it's funny. And yeah, there's not much in terms of new Legos. I got the Ninjagos. Five bucks for two minifigs. Not bad, not bad. The dream stuff. I don't think there's a minifig in that one. Uh, I don't see the, I didn't see the end cap with the Marvel stuff. If you know, you know. Um, yeah, there's not too much here. Uh, buildings, creator buildings. Assortment, city, city, carnival ride. Uh, Mars rover, that's kind of cool. And we got the Ahsoka and Anakin battle packs down there. Uh, I'm not sure what that Jedi thing is down there. That's got to be some little kid's thing. Uh, yeah. Oh, what is that? Is that the N1 Star? Oh, I got the N1 Starfighter here for you guys. Some helmets. And, oh, they got a Soka ship. So, eh, all right. Cool. All righty. All right. What do we have new over here? Absolutely nothing. Ah, oh, this is depressing. This is the only spot that's really depressing. I mean, Broadway's there. We got the... Shr battle damage shredder but <sighs> disappointing Raz al Ghul Piccolo Shanks Android 18 Journey into Mystery are those 15 bucks already? what? nah and no pops I don't know if they're getting rid of them and doing a reset but yeah, I haven't seen any new pops here in a minute yeah this is depressing this is this is why I don't show this section in every video. It literally looks like this every single time I'm here. All right, guys, I'm gonna wrap up the hunt there. I'm tired. It's been a long day. Uh, don't forget tomorrow for you guys watching this. If you're watching it Thursday, the 21st, tomorrow's PulseCon. Let me know down in the comments. What are you guys looking forward to seeing? What are you guys expecting to see? And uh, what are you guys hoping for? I'd like to know down in the comments. Me personally. I'd just like to see a couple more G1 Transformers, uh, a couple more G.I. Joe Pipeline reviews, just to see what's coming down the road. I mean, we already know we're going to see digital renders. We already know we're going to see new figures, whatever, the next wave, all that good stuff. We know we're going to see that. 
So, but I'd like to see some of the new pipelines, maybe uh, Alpine, you know, maybe, who knows? Because I know we already got Doc, and that was one of my two that I needed was Alpine and Doc, but we'll see. What else we got? Marvel. I want to see more X-Men figures. I want to see them do a retro card, a, a better retro card, Multiple Man. I need to finish X-Factor, and I'm not paying $70 for Multiple Man. <laughs> Maybe uh, get Wolf Spain, something like that. I just need more X Men figures. It's been, we got an X Men wave this year, and then they started with the the two three packs of two seven five. But I wanted more more sixtieth anniversary stuff than what we got. But we'll see. Anyways, down to brass tacks, down to seeing what we found. Recap. Bl uh, more Black Widow restock at the Kenosha Target. Otherwise, business as usual. Uh, Meyer had the new Puff Adder wave, so that for Meyer that's cool. They also had the. Did they have anything? Oh, they're still resetting. Plus, they had the new Legos, the Marvel uh, blind boxes. Is that what we're calling them? Yeah. <laughs> Walmart Racine, same thing. Just had the new Marvel Legos, Rock and Roll restock. Uh, they had that tons like what three four cases of the tvc restock that was kind of cool uh what else we got lando we thought we broke our lando streak at that tar or at that walmart last time no it turns out he was hiding in the back in the NECA section which i actually avoided that day because as you can see same old same old so we're back on track with lando we're down to just one store with no lando instead of two lando hunt continues Although that Duke Thomas infestation started to catch up. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, really, uh, racing target business as usual. Roadblocks, uh, the number 11 roadblocks back at uh, Burlington. I mean, we saw those earlier in the year, but now they're back. At least in my area. I don't know if you guys saw them, but they're back in. We had them earlier in my area, then they were gone, now they're back again. And that's about it. Ross had to stride horse. Anyways, guys, <laughs> we're already at three minutes of me blabbing my mouth. Let's go to the toy table so I can show off some stuff I picked up. Also, before I do that, let me know down in the comments also. Do you, you know, I didn't really get much feedback when I asked last time. Do you guys want to see, you know, Sunday night massive hauls? I mean, I don't get a lot, obviously, but, you know, would you like it all in one video? Or just a figure here and there on each video. I don't know. Let me know down in the comments. I'd appreciate it. Now, we're going to the toy table. And just like that, we are back at the toy table. What is going on, guys? We are here to see what I picked up from the last couple days. Uh, I'm still on the fence about doing the one pickup of, you know, one pickup video per week. You know, just to kind of put a little more content into one video because... There, there's weeks where I only pick up one or two things. It's hard to put one pickup in a week into three videos. So we'll see how it goes. All right, guys. Well, let's get this started. First pickup was finally found something on clearance. We got Batman 66 Batgirl. Um, I'm not going full in on this line, but there's a couple characters I wanted. She was one of them. So that's awesome. It's glad to pick that up. Uh, this one I did locate with a coupon, so got a deal. 14 bucks at Meyer with my $10 off coupon, so couldn't pass up Braun for that much. Uh, this lovely lady I got in during the restocks for my buddy Lucas because he needed one, so grabbed him one. So, Lucas, I got your Black Widow. Uh, you guys saw me questioning this uh, this one, and now that I have it in hand and got a closer look at it, it's actually supposed to look like this. It is the G3 Gundam, and no, I'm not going to go all in on this line because I don't know much about Gundam, but for 7-something, it looks cool, and it's worth a shot to see how these figures look. So I thought it was worth a uh, pick up and to check out. Uh, this one <laughs> has been the long game, but I won and I didn't win. So 
found or finally had the budget to pick up medieval spawn uh, i had a five dollar off coupon for thirty dollars worth of stuff while well, i had thirty dollars worth of stuff i picked up medieval spawn and i had something else in my cart when i got to the checkout and it was like came up to like 32 bucks plus tax and it didn't ring up right you know and i showed the lady i'm like well here i got a coupon for five bucks off da 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 da, da you know the whole spiel and she's like you know what i'll just give you five dollars off the toy here you go so eh, i still got my i got to keep my five dollar coupon and i still got spawned for 19.99 so that was a win uh, you guys saw, along with that Batgirl 66, I found Joker Eyes Joker. I did end up picking this up because I do want to get the four uh, Nolan Trilogy figures. And I like this This Joker. Looks a lot better than the regular one. I, I like the, the the purple and the against the black. The hair looks a little more... or The, the colors in the face and the hair look... They kick, they just stand out a little more. So I like the way this one looked. Uh, I'll end up trying to find the original head because I do want to build Bane. I want the whole, all four of them. But that's going to be the Joker I keep because that one looks really freaking good. And just like a lot of you, I got a Hasbro Pulse uh, pickup this week. My ladies came in. So that's kind of cool. Uh, this one's going to be fun when I get Bob. And that'll just go with the rest of my uh, Army Builder uh, Quakes I got. Because I got a, I think I picked up like five Quakes between all the Burlingtons that I went to. So, yeah, that is the haul, guys. I uh, hope you guys... Oh, I lied. That is not the haul. I was at Goodwill um, just looking... You know, I look at Goodwill once a month just to see if there's stuff like the tripod I'm using here is from Goodwill. And some other stuff is from Goodwill. Uh, but while I was there, for two bucks, found him. And I can't remember if this is from the two-pack or if this was an individual one, but I really liked Ragnarok. It was my favorite movie. And I don't, I think I have him already, but for two bucks, I was like, why not? And on top of that, he actually came with Stormbreaker. So, I mean, how often do you get accessories with figures at Goodwill? <laughs> so, I thought that was pretty cool. And, uh, guys, I'm going to get out of here, and I'm going to leave you with this. If you are a first-time viewer, repeat viewer, and you've not already subscribed to my channel, uh, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, join the tens of followers of Collecting Havoc. And since you've made it this far, you already see we like to have some fun on this channel, looking at toys, seeing what's out there, looking for deals, all kinds of good stuff. Uh... Also, I do appreciate if you hit that like button, because if you notice, when you hit the like button on videos like mine, you will have to pause and get a call. <laughs> Gotta remember, guys, when you're recording, put your phone on mute. <laughs> so anyways, where was I? Oh, yeah. When you hit the like button on my video, because I, I label my videos as toy hunts. YouTube will see that you like toy hunt videos and will recommend other toy hunt videos to you. You may find another toy hunt, uh, toy hunter out there that you may like. Um, might be how you found me, but hit that like button. It lets YouTube know the kind of videos you like. Also, if you want to know when I'm dropping content, hit the notification bell. Turn on the notifications in your YouTube app so that you know when I am dropping video along with the other creators that you subscribe to drop their content. On that note, guys... Catch you next time.